Hi, I'm Ryan for Ryan's Guitar Stuff, and today's video is actually not on screen at the moment. Give me a second. So, just to say what I'm doing here, I'm using pedals as a cap sim. I'm using the AT505 as an amp sim, and you can see how I have that set up as above. And then the main pedal I am demonstrating in this video is this one down here. This is the tube driver by Nick Crow Labs. I actually quite like their um, VSTs. And this is their um, tube driver pedal, or rack mounted, or just VST in general actually. So you can kind of get from the name what it's meant to be. Okay, so well, here's what the clean sound. <laughs> That's the clean sound, and now if I was to drive it a bit, so um, I'm driving this a lot, by the way. So you can kind of see with and without the pedal, well, VST engaged. Personally, um. I don't like the idea of an EQ. In my pedal, being honest, if I was going to, I'd rather it be a tone control, to be honest. Um, just because it's much simpler, easier, and faster. Um, other than that, it's actually a really nice sound. Um, and unlike, say, for the Necro, the A505 there on screen, it's a very distorted amp, whereas this is. It's a nice. Um, just twangy, not just twangy, but it's not as heavy as the amp was, and it's actually just a very light distortion, which is nice. It's the kind of VST you would add to, so for example, here's the A505 without the pedal, and then with the pedal. It kicks it into gear, which a tube driver. Would do, which is nice. It kicks it up a notch in a sense. It takes your crunch sound to a lead sound in a sense, which is nice. Um, I turn this down a little, so there's no fuzz in the background, because I actually have my speaker next to my camera. That's why I, you. It's a long story. Anyway, um, it's a nice VST. It's very, it's not delayed in the sense that, like, oh. It's a bit delayed when you're playing faster, but it's not as bad as other VSTs where it can be kind of off-putting. So yeah, it's a nice VST, it's very responsive in the sense that it's not much latency in it. And there's also latency introduced by my sound card and everything. Um, but I've had VSTs in the past that were very, very delayed. So yeah, I've been Ryan, and this has been the Necro Tube Driver Delay. It's a very nice, uh, not delay, dr Tube Driver Drive, my mistake. Um, few things on it. Um, you can have the mono, you can have a phase, other things, sample, all that kind of stuff on a normal VST. And yeah, it's just a really nice drive sound. So, yeah, it's a really nice drive sound and I quite like it. So, I've been Ryan from Ryan's Guitar Stuff. So see you in the next video, like, comment, subscribe, all that's the good stuff. And see you.